Microsoft Focus Points and Cisco Focus Points. This is this week's Ask Me Anything. Stay tuned. Hey everybody, this is Zach with IT Career Questions, and this week, Charles Owens asked the following question, and bear with me because I'm going to try to read this off my computer screen all the way over there. Uh, Charles Owens asked, I was looking into degree in information tech. I am offered two focus points, one of which is Microsoft Focus, and the other is Cisco Focus. Can you explain the difference in both and give your opinion on which you believe is best? Thanks. You're welcome. So I'm going to try to answer this question the best that I possibly can. Um, I'm going to try to think that whatever college or trade school that you're at has some type of wordage that relates to your, your focus points here, I guess. Uh, because the Microsoft focus could really mean many different things and uh, you'd really have to give me more information to drill down into that. But if you're really comparing Microsoft to Cisco, I'm going to have to go ahead and think that Microsoft might be more something towards the server side of things. So if you're looking at a Microsoft focus, that might be something that really focuses mainly on some type of a server administration for Windows. So think of a Windows server administrator type of role. So you'll be managing primarily Windows servers. You're maybe an Active Directory a lot. You are doing Exchange, which is another Microsoft uh, feature, of course, where you're, with your Outlook, your email, of course, you're going to have to know Office, all of that fun stuff. Uh, but of course, there's, you know, SCCM, which is another Microsoft tool. Um, you know, Hyper-V is something that, again, is, is brought to you by Microsoft as well. Um, so having a Microsoft focus point might give you a really in-depth uh, exploration into that or those specific areas of Microsoft, and it could be something completely different. I'm not really sure uh, what exactly they're offering for you. But for me, when you're saying Microsoft and comparing it to Cisco, I'm going to think that you're going to be some type of server administrator, primarily focusing on Microsoft servers. So, you know, whatever Windows server that's currently out, 2016 will be out in September. So that's very, very soon. Uh, but you know, you'll be, you know, uh, working on 2012 servers, probably 2008 even. Um, so you'll probably get a lot of information on being a system administrator, some type of role like that. Uh, the next part of that question is the Cisco stuff. That's all networking, everything networking, 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 networking. And you'll mainly be working on the Cisco equipment. So all types of Cisco switches, routers, and the configuration related to Cisco stuff. And keep in mind that a lot of businesses do use Cisco, uh, but there's also HP equipment out there for networking. So uh, this primarily will focus on Cisco. So that's just the biggest one that's out there really. So it's a great, great resource anyway to learn. Uh, but if you're in the networking, if you wanna you know, really dive deep into setting up VLANs and LANs and WANs and uh, all those types of things, that is probably a good focus for you. It really depends on what you want to do. I can't tell you which one is better because that's really my opinion. And your opinion may be completely different than me. But if I were to choose between the two, I, I would probably go for the Cisco focus. And that's only because I already know as much as I want to know from the server side of things. So from the Microsoft stuff, I feel comfortable with that entire area. I can, you know, get my way through all of that stuff. The networking stuff, on the other hand, is something that I don't, I don't have a very strong grasp on. Uh, I can definitely, you know, get my way through that as much as I can, but I would definitely love to learn more. And the Cisco type of jobs pay really, really well. And I really like to make a lot of money. So um, I would personally go for Cisco, but it could be completely different. Um, that, that's basically me answering this question for you because it's kind of hard to answer because I have an opinion and you have an opinion and they could be completely different. And if you guys who are watching this video have your own opinion, I think Charles Owens would really love to hear what your opinion is on the matter. Which side of the field do you guys really like and why? Why do you like the server side of things compared to the networking side of things or vice versa? What makes you really excited about networking compared to the server administration stuff? 
please feel free to leave a comment below. Let Charles know. Let me know. Because I'd really love to hear from you guys on which is your favorite part of IT in regards to server administration and network administration. What is it that you guys are looking to do? Let me know. Leave a comment below. Love to hear from you guys. As always, you know I greatly appreciate it. And of course, take it easy.